though. My legs are starting to stick together. Anyway. Hello and welcome to the Weirdest Kingdom on this side of YouTube. I'm Princess Adia, aka Adia, and welcome to my channel. Woo 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 woo. Hello, hello. Um, so today I am doing the first this kind of haul for the first time. I'm doing a haul for the first time in a very long time, like clothing haul. Um, I am doing a swimsuit haul. Um, I am doing a try on, I'm trying on these things. So first all around, but I have a difficult, sometimes I have a difficult time finding swimsuits in my kind of style, you know, sort of alternative pastel colorful style because you know, also finding things that I would actually want to wear because I'm not necessarily like the high cut, high leg, thong kind of bikini bathing suit thing. I just don't want that. Also finding swimsuits now my size that I like has made sort of a problem. I am a size 12 so basically something that I, things that I think other people would like that have the same similar style as me or you know whatever so I don't have a lot because obviously I don't need that many I have some from Target ASOS and mod cloth I'm very excited for the mod cloth ones because I think those might be my favorite out of the bunch who knows so for my first bikini I got this pink high waist this no, pink Ooh, purple pastel purple high-waisted um, bikini um, it is this looks like this um, I am a little bit worried about this coverage just for the sense that my boob does move around a lot I don't know when I try it on I will see but um, it does have adjustable straps so if I need to change it because I do have quite small shoulders so we'll see that um then also it also has like a little tie in the front i don't think the tie yeah the tie doesn't really necessarily change anything for how tight or anything like that it's just a little tight um yeah and it comes with a little hook thingy i don't even know what this is called um and this is from target i got the top in a large 810 I think I should have gone for like a double D the D to double D one because again I don't know but we'll see but they didn't have that in cup size so I also was unsure so and then I also got this in a large which I should have gone for an extra large but the they fit fine I've kind of tried them on but I didn't show them on camera so okay so my tattoos on view so this is the the purple one it is covering but it is a high cut I yeah it's covering my butt also the reason I don't like the like thong underwear is because there's a lot going on in here <laughs> and it, it'll just I don't want a wedgie I don't want to give my chance to give me like a really really bad wedgie and that is what I think about like when I see like thong bikinis <laughs> so yeah um this is what it looks like I really like this on me um yeah I really like this on me honestly and this is quite I can tighten it if I want to but I have it on the loose the last one here and like the loosest attachment and it's this is perfect honestly I was worried about it not fitting me too well but this is perfectly fine I love this so much also just going forward I do have my underwear on for the bottom so that's why if it looks all bunchy but yep um, the next one is also from Target. Um, they had like a kids version to it and I was really looking for the adult version because I'm like, oh my god, that'd be so cute to wear. But they only had, I could only find the kids version up until I looked and found them. Um, it is this blue gingham set. So this is the bottoms. They're like 
kind of these like vintage 60s stuff but like 50s but then the top is this really cute like bandeau but what really sold me on this top was the bow even though I probably have to like undo that to put it on but the top this little bow sold me I really hope I can get this bow to look as clean as before but yes um I got this top in a double a D double D so I think this might fit better than the other one this is like very vintage inspired because it will seem right down the middle of the the bottoms which remind me of like 50s like short shorts or daisy dukes kind of. hello um just going to say this going forward my bangs are going to get progressively worse as this video goes on through the try on portions um i completely didn't realize that my bangs were like that also kind of just gave up after the first time i fixed them so anyway okay enjoy so here's the next one let me t i like this one as well <laughs> like i really like this one um i like how full coverage it is like nothing is showing and i kind of like that just because again it has no chance of going up my butt honestly and i'm like pulling on it to make sure it doesn't go up nothing's happening and this top is really cute too there is like this like boning on the side here as like protection but like I guess to give kind of good support but like I don't feel that was too much I don't feel that like I'm going to like fall out of this like I feel very covered everywhere also I just yeah it's cute the color looks nice on my skin it does look kind of like yeah it looks blue I was gonna say it looks purple but also this like this is kind of like a creamish color can't I don't know if you can see it on camera it's like not like white it's like an off-white kind of so I guess it works really well with this blue I couldn't handle myself I had to get myself a gingham bathing suit also the bow on the back looks really cute this next one is from ASOS and I really liked it but there were other ones that I think I wanted to get but I didn't want to do overdo it and get so many different um, swims like one pieces so it is this one which way is the front okay this way is the front so this is this one piece that is um, a yellow number uh, it's very it's coming up a little bit more neon but it's like this nice like buttercup color and it has it's a cutout as you can see my face can fit right <laughs> through but um yeah i don't know what to say about this because this is quite cute but um i got this one in a size 12 i don't know how that's going to fit because i feel like sometimes bathing suits you can sometimes size down it'll be fine because they stretch and stuff but um yeah we'll see okay <laughs> okay so this is the next one maybe it's just me but like this feels very exposing also I this is so hard to tie up and I don't think I actually like this that much I'm really excited for this one but I don't think I like this one basically everything I bought from ASOS I also bought other things from ASOS with this order with these bathing suit I have this in the back <laughs> um yeah Okay, anyway, let's get into this the whole swimsuit situation. So, this is comfortable. Like, I feel comfortable. And it looks like a two-piece, like two but it's a one-piece. Um, these ruffles just... Uh -uh. I also feel so, like, it's hard to tie on a back, on a tie. Like, I couldn't tell which one was the front and the back because it basically kind of looks the same. Um, I don't know. I don't really like this one. Mm. yeah it, it's just like there's not enough I can't tie it tight enough I don't feel supported in this I don't feel that if I like I feel like this could come out it's very loose here there's, I can't tighten any of this so yeah no this is not the one the color looks nice on me but I don't think I like this whole ruffle situation it's not the cutest 
so yeah that's a no for me the next one I literally like this one this one is one of my favorites this is from mod cloth um this is this it's another cutout like one piece but it's this really cute rainbow number this is like the best thing ever and it's like I just love it and it's like a little t twist tie in the front and I th don't this one as well doesn't like really mess with the top so if I wanted to take this off I could but I don't have a reason to want to take this off this is so cute I got this in extra large. This is the mod. Wow. I really like this one. The rainbows look nice. Also, it does. I can tighten the straps. It, it fits. Like, this is what I was expecting the other one to fit like. There's a cutout in the back as well. And it f comes, like, all the way down here. So, like, another one didn't. Like, it was just kind of like one whole piece, but it covers so you have some better coverage there are pads in this one it's a lot easier to put on <laughs> too because this is a class but I literally didn't even take it off because it's on the loosest one I just this was a win the rainbow looks really great though the protective liner and the crotch area is not very comfortable but this looks so cute oh my gosh and the last one is this one piece from a lot of cloth as well but it's from Esther Williams and it's just the cutest thing ever there's like a red one I wanted but I was kind of discouraged because everyone was telling me that it was actually ugly but I don't think so I think it's very cute and I wish I would have gotten it but anyway this is very cute like I love it it looks like a little outfit but then on the back it has this little cute like bow that like blends in with the bottom half and another twist tie. I like the twist tie thing for some reason and I don't yeah this as well doesn't mess with the oh wait maybe I'm wrong I don't know I'll figure it out when I put it on another cool thing about them it's a good and bad thing is that um there are is padding in this but this one it has like a built-in bra kind of thing so it gives you some good support I guess would give you some good support yeah isn't this so cute this is just like the cutest thing ever okay and i got this in a size 12. this is actually quite cute like honestly i thought i was at first a little bit apprehensive about it playing it on i had a trouble like figuring out which way this went because it was like inside <laughs> i was like oh no anyway but yeah it looks cute i thought i was i thought i was wearing it wrong because it does like there's like some extra space here but no, it's just, yeah. The legs are a little bit uncomfortable. They're quite tight, but I guess it helps with keeping your thing. But I could always pull it down. I definitely did a great, good, good thing I went with a 12 instead of a 10. Because then the legs here would have been really tight. Like, these are kind of, like, uncomfortable just a little bit, but they're not completely tight. And I think over time in the water, they'll probably forget about them. Yeah, I like this. It's really cute. Full cover up in the back. It's supportive and the bra thing I don't really think it makes a difference I do think that the cups are quite weird and it's upsetting that I can't like not that I would take them out but like on the side you can kind of see them so those are all my swimsuits um I really like them I don't think I'm gonna be buying any swimsuits again like next year or anything like that because I don't want to over consume unless it's like I gain weight and I can't fit these anymore which will be very sad because I love these um, then I will buy new ones, but really I don't have a need to buy any more, so I bought them out of necessity because I really needed them and, well, didn't need them, but I wanted to get some that actually fit me and stuff, so, yes. Also, I have not done makeup for, like, the last two videos. I just didn't feel like doing it, um, so I hope that's okay with everyone. I hope you liked all these swimsuits. I'm going to leave the link to them in the description. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!